الحمد لله رب العالمين الرحمن الرحيم. So how do you, how you guys differ from Christians? Like how Great you... question. So let's begin with that, right? Oh, yeah. We believe in the true message of Jesus. Peace okay. and blessings be upon him, right? For example, if you look at your own belief, yeah. do you believe God knows everything? Yeah. Do we believe God knows everything? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. So if God didn't know, he wouldn't be God, right? Like yeah. if he didn't know, right? Yeah. So do you believe Jesus is God? Uh, uh, what we were taught is yeah. that he was a, a human form as his child, as a representation of God. God. Is Jesus God? Jesus is God's son. But is he God himself? Is he a part of God? Well, yeah, yeah, he's, he's a son. He's a part. Okay. Yeah, he's so, a son. So he has all the characteristics of God. Or no? Oh, so uh, what I was, I was, this is what I was taught. Right, right. What we were taught was that his characteristics was that um, he came to uh, repent the sins gotcha. that humans did. Gotcha. And he said hey, Jesus is a representation, almost like a prophet. Okay, so, I'm, I'm with you guys. This is that, good. Right? All right. So, like I said, this is what I was so yeah. if you look in the Bible, for example, the pages. Yeah, I use the same Bible as we. Huh? The pages. No, they use the Quran. The pages folded. Oh no no. Uh, there's a lot more. Uh, that's just. Uh, oh, I mean, we can go with that, right? So uh, we we. This is the Old and New Testament, the Bible. This is the Quran, right? This we believe has been changed. Right? People authored things into it. Anonymous authors, and I'll show that to you in a minute. I have another right? question. Go ahead. You guys read the same way the Bible did, because they they start from the left side. We, we see right to left. Right, this is the Arabic, right? But this is the English translation, so this will go in the way that English reads, right? So here, for example, this is the folded page. This is just your qadr that Allah wrote for you to read, right? John uh, chapter 17, verse 3. And this is eternal life that you may know, that they may know you, the only true God and Jesus Christ whom you have sent. So this, even this here, even after all the changes, it shows that there is one only true God and Jesus was sent, right? Like you said, like a prophet, right? We're, we're with that. We Muslims believe in Jesus. We believe he had a miraculous birth. I did not know that. Yes, we believe in Mary. I thought you guys believed, uh, I thought it was uh, Muhammad, not Jesus. We believe in Muhammad, we believe in Jesus. I'm glad you came today, we can clear this up, right? We believe in all the prophets, Abraham, Moses, Jesus, Muhammad, peace and blessings be upon them. We love them all. Even the Jewish? Even the Jewish? Those are all Muslim to us. Oh, yeah. To us, Jesus was a Muslim. I have a question. Is, uh, yeah. is, is Islam older than uh, Jewish? Yes. Really? Islam is the true religion from the time of Adam, from Adam. Abraham was a Muslim, Moses was a Muslim, Jesus was a Muslim, Muhammad was a Muslim. Peace and blessings be upon all of them. We love them. You never see a Muslim disrespect Jesus. Like, you know, they make caricatures and cartoons of the Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him. They burn the Quran and things. You don't see us making fun of the Prophet Jesus because we love him. We love Abraham, we love Moses. We, even when I say their name, I say, alayhim salam, peace be upon them. Right? Salam alaikum. So you're from Philippines, right? Yes. How do you say thank you? Salamat. Salamat. There you go, because the Philippines used to be all Muslim. Yeah. yeah. Before the Spanish came and raped and, <laughs> and did all their horrible stuff and changed the language and all that, you see the that's why in Mindanao you still have Muslims, right? Yep. That's yes. why Min Allah. Yeah. Minilla. It came from an Arabic name, right? You say Salamat Po, right? Which has come from Salam, right? I did not know that. That's a, you learned something new today, man. That's beautiful. No, I'm, I'm, I'm Pashtun. I'm, I'm from a different race, right? I'm not Arab, but I learned Arabic. So, this um, Pashtun, is that almost the same thing as Shiite and Sunni? No, no, no. Shiite and Sunni are sects. Uh, yeah. Pashtuns are ethnicity, right? Uh, so, from Afghanistan and northern Pakistan, these areas are Pashtun. It, it makes sense. It makes sense. Yeah. But in Islam, we only have one Islam. Because we only have one Quran. For example, let me show you something, right? You're Catholic? Which one is you? Well, it's race Catholic, right? Yes. This is the Catholic, oh, this is the study Bible, sorry. This, this is the Catholic Bible, okay? So if you look at this, you will see in the Catholic Bible, chapters you will not find in the Protestant Bible. So you see this is Tobit and Judith and the Siraj right yeah. here, Baroch, these ones. Now if you look at this here, and now this is a uh, where, yeah, King James Version, yeah, yeah, yeah. Christian Bible, the regular that you guys see all the time, right? Now if you look at the table of contents, there is no Tobit here. 
right? Go through it. You can look at yeah, it, yeah, right? Yeah. Those chapters are in the Catholic Bible, but not in the Protestant Bible. Yeah. All right? We're going to do a fun social experiment today. You going to have some fun? Yeah, good. All right, cool. What's your name? Francisco. Francisco. CJ. CJ. All right. Here, this is Luke 9, verse 56. Okay. All right, hold it for me. Yeah. All right. Francisco. This is the Mormon Bible, the New World Translation. Okay? It's a lot. Yeah. But you Same. guys only have one book though. Only one Quran. Yeah, but right? like the Canadian Christianity, like there are there are many different kinds of Bibles. So now this is same Luke 9, 56, right? Yes. You read, so yeah, so you yeah, read yours first says, and you read yours. For the Son of the Man did not come to destroy men's lives, but to save them. Okay. So they went to a different village. <laughs> now check it. Is it the same verse, same it's chapter? Not, it's not. This is not the same. No, but look at the numbering. The same 56. Verse 56. Verse 56. Yeah. You see that? So this is Mormon. Yeah, this is Mormon. This is this is Joe Witnesses. Right? Oh, the Joe, book of Joe, Joe, yeah, Joe. the book of Mormons a whole different and that's another one, right? Really right. This is Joe Witnesses. This Joe, is their translation. Yeah, Elvis Witness. Yeah. Okay. The, the New guys, World Translation. The yeah, the ones that bother you. Oh, the oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Right? <laughs> now let me show I you. I mean something. I love all, all the cultures, you know. So yeah, yeah, and it's not about cultures, this is a belief yeah. set, right? Yeah. Now we're gonna continue our fun. So you see that, right? The, yeah. the Catholic Bible, the the Joe Witness, I'm sorry, and the uh, King James all have differences, right? Yeah. Now let me show you something. This is this is a regular King James version, right? Um, this is Matthew, which is the beginning of the cha the New Testament, right? So read for me here, Matthew. This is the first chapter, verse 16. And Jacob, go ahead. And Jacob begot Joseph, the husband of Mary, of whom was born Jesus, who is called Christ. So who's the father of Joseph? Yeah. Jacob, Jacob. Yeah. begot. I mean, and, and it's not about Mary. He's talking about Joseph because it clearly says that it's Mary's husband, right? So who's the father of Joseph? Jacob. Jacob. Excellent. Same same Bible. Not not looking at a different translation. Now we're gonna go look at it in Luke, right? So read from Luke three twenty three. The son of the uh, so, so start from here now. Now Jesus himself began his ministry at about 30 years of age, as was supposed. The son of Joseph, the son of Eli. So who's the father of Joseph here? Eli. You see that? Eli Muslim? No, no. I mean, I don't know who Eli was traditionally. He could have been Muslim. But you see the, the clear contradictions there. Because these books were written later on. This is from a Christian who wrote a whole book on Luke. Right? This is a Reverend David Teedy. He's a Lutheran and he's a professor. And he tells us right here, he goes, the narrative remains Luke, an anonymous ancient document of uncertain origins. We don't even know who wrote these books, right? He says, while the narrative never identifies the author by name, and it's Christian, so it's not a Muslim, right? He goes, there is no name, Luke, or in Acts, right? or personal history or traditions, but it dated to second, to the late part of second and early third century. Early third century, there was there, there, there's the earliest dating, right? The earliest manuscript that you see is in the fourth century, right? The, the complete manuscript being seven. So these were all written way after Jesus. These aren't the words of Jesus. This is not the gospel of Jesus. Yeah, that, Even that, if that, you get... Yes, there, there, there has been plenty of... Uh, yeah, yeah right. that, that's why they always say that the Bible itself is not the original copy. It's not. It because it, Look, okay. this is a study Bible. This is what they study in universities and Protestants and, and preachers, the MacArthur Study Bible. Under the chapter of Hebrews, he says, the author of Hebrews is unknown. That's why you have many, like, just Christian, like, uh, separations from Catholicism, Protestant, Lutheran, Methodist. Now, I'm going to show you one that's going to blow your mind away, right? And you're going to read it just so you don't think I'm messing with it, right? Second Kings 8, 26. Isaiah was 20 years old when he became king and he resigned. He reigned one year in Jerusalem. Okay, so how old was he? 22, right? It says 20. It says 22, 22 years old, right? Now in the same Bible, we're going to go to now Chronicles. That was 2nd James, right? Yeah. 2nd Chronicles. 
Chapter 22, verse 2. Go ahead. Isaiah was 40, 42 years old when he became king. He resigned with 20 years in Israel. You saw the earlier one, he was 22, and here he's what? 42. 42. How old was he? Right? Now, I looked it up in a study Bible to know what Christian scholars said. This is there. This is a copyist error. <laughs> They're telling you there's errors in the Bible. Right? So, I have the Greek Bible, right? I'll show it to you. This is the Greek Bible, right? And this shows you the English translation and all of Look at the differences between each page between the different manuscripts. Yeah. The contradictions and errors. So what does that tell you? This is not preserved. This Quran, you have a Quran? I don't. You do now. Thank it's you. free. I will read. I will you have one too, Christopher. All free from us, right? This is the preserved message of God. Without changes, without alterations, without man's additions, without any contradictions, right? And that's why... Where are the, like... Chat the... Just from the beginning, go for it. So this is, uh, I'll show you. So, Quran. This is the Quran, the final revelation of God. I want right? to make my own Hajj to Mecca one day too. That's it, you're becoming Muslim today, yeah. and then I'm going to plan out your Hajj, no problem. Right? <laughs> With a hotel and everything? Hotel and flights, all of that, bro, I got you. Don't worry about nothing. Alhamdulillah. Right? Alhamdulillah. There you go, man, you know it. All right, look, these are the Chapter. chapters. This is the beginning, Al-Fatiha. And we'll go through all of them until Surah An Nas, which is the last chapter, 114 chapters. I, 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 am, I am too curious. Like, how many times have you prayed today? Uh, my obligatory prayers. This was my third. Yes. We're gonna have five. Have five so more. Fajr, Tahr, Asr, uh -huh. and then I'm gonna pray Maghrib, Isha, and then there are non-obligatory that I pray um, on top of that. One other thing is like, I, I love the way you guys pray. It's like, uh, like nice. you, you guys like sing the verses, or like yes, we read the Quran in the prayer. Oh, so in that's so like, and you guys like sing it, right? Yeah, yeah. In a, I mean, not like a song, but in a beautiful voice, yeah, right? Beautiful voice. So we recite the first one, Al Fatiha. Yeah. That's the first chapter there. We recite in every prayer, in every unit, every rakah, uh, that's, right? That's and then we add other verses from the Quran with it. And uh, what's your favorite uh, verse or quote? In the Quran? Oh, it's very hard to say. Uh, the whole Quran is so beautiful. I personally have a very strong uh, love for uh, Surah Yu Yusuf, the, the chapter of show Joseph. Me, show, show, uh, I got you. That's and Surah very, Rahman. Very yeah. beautiful. They're gonna learn Joseph. About yeah. So right here. Joseph. I mean Yusuf alayhi salam, right? It's a very, very beautiful surah. Uh, I loved it so much, I named my first son Yusuf. Wow. <laughs> uh, I, all my children, I wanted to name after prophets that were mentioned in the Quran. I heard this uh, one uh, verse in the Quran, it says, it's like, and it became like my favorite one too, it's just like, even if you're not rich, you can offer a smile to the poor. You know? There you go, there's a hadith that mentions that smiling is a charity, that's yeah, beautiful. That's, I love that. Yeah. So that's it, man. This is uh, another beautiful, is Ar Rahman. To, like, the most I would love mercy. to learn this. You, you have, pro is there like a power, like one of my favorite books in in the Bible, it's Proverbs. Is there like a Proverbs here too? So the whole Quran has uh, the linguistic beauty of language in it, okay. right? Yeah. When you when you get to know the Arabic Quran, uh, we'll go through, inshallah, after you become Muslim, we'll go through lessons of how to understand Arabic grammar and how to understand the, what we call imthal and tashbih and balagha, taqdeem wa taakhir. We will benefit from all of that. But the first thing is, look, let me tell you this. One God, yeah. no kids, no roommates, no none of that, sent prophets. Yeah. Abraham, Moses, Muhammad. Doesn't that make sense? Yeah, no, yeah. Does that makes sense no, to I, you? I believe that, yeah. Khalas, you're Muslim. Yeah. That's your Muslim yeah. then. That's, That's a Muslim, Muslim belief. God. Where do you live? Where do I live? I live in Oceanside. Oceanside? Yeah. What about you? I'm not from here. I'm from uh, South Carolina. South Carolina? Khalas, we're going to get your contact info. But if that's what you believe, that there's one God, yeah, yeah. and you believe he sent those prophets, the first being Adam, the last being Muhammad, you're Muslim. Exactly. You're no longer Christian. That's not the Christian belief. That's the Muslim belief, right? So that's it. We're going to do your shahada. You're going to do your acceptance. You're going to be Muslim. And then we're going to plan your hajj. You're going to go with him? To Mecca? One day, one day. Let's do this. Right. Work first. Work hmm? first. After work, no worry. But okay. you believe in this one God? Yes. You believe that Muhammad is the prophet? Who's Muhammad? Uh, Muhammad, um, <laughs> oh, wait, the prophet. Oh, okay. The prophet yeah. Muhammad, the last yeah. prophet. Yeah. Okay. The one, the, the one that yeah. says it right here. The Quran was revealed to. You believe in the prophet Muhammad? Yeah, he's the prophet. Yeah. Okay, he believes it. You believe it? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I, I know. All right, that's it. Okay. Arabic first or English first? English. 
English. Yeah, All right. Oh, I was confused about that. I, mean, I, would I, I would love to learn Arabic. Language, you know? We will teach you Arabic. I'll give you a, our YouTube channel. You're going to go to Arabic classes. But all right. So I bear witness. Say it with me. You're becoming Muslim right now. That's it. Uh, uh, you're there. Let me, let me what do you mean? What, what are you going to think about? Look, look, look. We, 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 we want to learn the culture first. No problem. Listen, 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 listen. I got you. You know. You can learn all of that. I'll show you our website. You can go through, you can learn about the prayer. Because the culture. there's actually like a Muslim, uh, no, a Jewish stand over there that we also can see that we also learn. Yeah, good, so. good, good. But what's your belief? You believe in one God? Yes. So that's, you don't believe you in have to ask me, um, I want to say uh, there is one God, you know. Okay, good. Then, but, then that's the belief. Yeah, that's but what? There is no buts, right? You believe in one God. You believe that He sent prophets. That's the Muslim belief. Right? If you have that, whether you say it or not, you're already Muslim. In your heart, right? The Shahada is your testimony. You want to learn the prayer, I'm going to teach you the prayer. You want to learn how to do the evolution, I'm going to teach you the evolution. When to pray, Ramadan is coming, we're going to fast together. Oh, no. Oh, no. and fasting is fun, bro. No, no. Fasting is that you don't eat for the day, but you only eat and close your house. See, you already know all that. The thing is, night. The, the Wait, isn't it like a week you don't eat, or like three days? No, no, it's a month. But we, we don't, you don't eat. eat. You don't eat the whole, no, no, no. you eat at night. No, no, you eat at night. You, you know intermediate fasting? Yeah, you only yeah. you don't eat when the sun's up, but when you only eat during the night. Yeah. Sometimes right, so from the evening onwards, you eat until the sun rises. Yeah. It's going to cleanse you physically, spiritually. You're going to come out a better person. Right? So? Yeah, of course. I know so. I've been through so many Ramadans. I, mean, I, go, I go crazy though. No, no, no. Yeah. Look, you, you, you know, in his job, in his profession, uh, what, profession what do you do? Uh, in the military. I could tell. But, uh, what do you do in the military? I'm a networker. A what? Networker. A networker. So what do you do in network? Like the network support? Yeah. Okay, so it's not that difficult. You're not jumping out of planes or anything, right? And if you're... Uh, but he's, he, lives out, he lives out there in the wild. Okay, no problem. Look, if you're traveling, you don't have to fast. You can make it up when you get back. If you're sick, you don't have to fast. Allah never puts a burden upon you more than you can handle, right? But what is key? Shaitan, the devil, he wants to make you procrastinate. What's his name? Shaitan. Shaitan. Yeah. Oh, that's okay. the devil. Well, it sounds, it sounds familiar to me. Yeah, yeah. He's been whispering in our ears since we were little, right? But you got to fight the shaitan. So if you, if you have that belief that there is one God and those are the prophet, then you have to be Muslim, right? Now, after that, you're going to learn. You have a lifetime to learn. I will give you websites. I'll give you contact information so you can ask all your questions. You can oh, learn the take, this too. take everyone, anything you want. Take it. It's all free. Yeah. All right. Let me ask you this. Do y'all believe in heaven? Yes. In hell? Yes. But we don't believe we don't believe in heaven and hell being like the way Christians do, like as if the devil is going to rule in hell. Hell is a punishment you can't imagine. Right? And heaven is so beautiful. We're not going to be sitting on clouds playing harps like a bunch of, you know, fruit <laughs> dudes. Or like, nah. being, being Christian, I wouldn't doubt. I wouldn't. Nah. As a Muslim, we believe in you're Muslim now. You can't call yourself Christian anymore, right? As a Muslim, you're going to believe that there is one creator. That creator created heaven as his mercy. And when you go to heaven, you won't die anymore. Your physical appearance will be different. You live forever, no sickness, none of that. But wait, do you believe in that Jesus died on the cross for us? No, right? But think through that. No, no, no. We believe Jesus was a prophet, but we don't believe he died on the cross. We believe whoever was killed on the cross was not Jesus. Allah protected him. And we believe he will come back, right? Think about this, right? Let, let's take it to a core belief. Let's say, uh, CJ, you go into a store and you steal something. I know you wouldn't, but I'm just saying, let's say you did, right? And then the store owner's like, hey, you shouldn't have stolen that. You're like, I feel bad about it. Can I make up for it? Can I repent? And the store owner tells you, the only way to repent is you kill my son, my perfect, innocent son, murder him, and that makes up for your sins. That doesn't make sense, right? Why would Jesus have to be murdered and tortured? Allah is forgiving. If you sin, you ask for forgiveness, Allah forgives you. He's not going to kill his son. Like, the, like you, you don't have kids, you guys are young, right? But I got kids. There is nobody more, more from the family and the friends, that, the acquaintance around us that, is, that are alive today, that are closer to me than my kids. I love my mom, I love my wife, I love my kids. If anybody was to kill my son, it's on. Man, I'm not, I'm not, you're not going to make it past that. I don't care about the law, right? Why? Because that's my blood. That's what, if my son is an innocent son and you kill him, you think that's going to give you forgiveness? Heck no, that doesn't make no sense, right? We Muslims, you don't believe that, we don't believe that. 
All right. You ready? Let's do this. What are you waiting for? You already know, man. It's okay. You sure? Yeah. I got no pressure. We got you guys. But listen, salam. Listen, listen. Don't let the devil procrastinate. Read up. Come back. Saturday, Sundays, we're here. We're gonna have Dira Islam. All right. So we can go to Mecca together. إذا أعجبك الفيديو لا تنسى الإعجاب والتعليق ولكي يصلك كل جديد اشترك الآن